Hello everyone, I hope you're keeping well and I hope you had a really good uh, Easter weekend. And uh, yeah, I uh, went up to my mom's for Easter and uh, there was a buy to get two free candles at Bath and Body Works. So I didn't have a chance to go till today. So um, I went to the mall and I picked up about eight candles actually from Bath and Body Works. So uh, with the 20% off, it worked out to be about $10.20 per candle, which isn't too bad. So um, I did buy some that I've purchased before and some new ones. And also um, I ordered some Scentsy Wax Melts from uh, Patricia. She has a channel, uh, Patricia Noses to Toes. Uh, so I'll try to remember to link her channel below. And if you go on to her description, you can click on uh, to the Scentsy site and you can order um, wax melts from her. So I did that and I have a lot of Scentsies, but there are a lot of uh, winter and fall scents. And uh, so I picked up some nice spring summery bright scents. And then, um, well, I'll start with the uh, DW candle. I have to go into Marshall's to cut through to get to Bath and Body Works. So if you see my other um, videos previously, I really do like this cucumber water and I can only find the uh, one wick. And uh, yeah, I really wanted to find a two wick. So I did get the two wick cucumber water. And this is 15 ounces. And yeah, it just, it's a very authentic, clean, fresh, watery cucumber scent. And yeah, I have two one wick candles, so I probably should have tried those out first before I got carried away. Um, but anyway, I just, I absolutely love this on cold. It's, it's very, very authentic. Okay, so the Bath and Body Works uh, candles. So I will start. Um, these two, uh, I blame this on Meyer and Kyla. Uh, they said they really liked these two scents. And um, so yeah, I, I did sniff these and uh, definitely want to pick these ones up. And so the first Bath and Body Works one is Strawberry Pound Cake. And it has a really, really pretty lid on it. And I love strawberry scents. I don't care if they're authentic, if they're fake. I just, they bring back great childhood memories, so I do really love strawberry scents. And actually in the kitchen right now, I have the lemon drop um, candle going. And then in my warmer, I have sunlit <coughs> strawberry patch. And this one's kind of overtaking the lemon drop one, but it's the lemon and the strawberry together are a really, really nice blend. And this is very, very strong. Just love that one. Anyway, go back to strawberry pound cake. So yeah, it's it's not as strawberry-ish, if that's a word, as this one. This is like straight up strawberry. Um, but it there's a lot of cake batter, I find, when I'm sniffing it on cold. So I don't know if the strawberry maybe comes out a little bit more. But yeah, I do get cake batter and um, some... Uh, strawberry. So hopefully the strawberry will come out a little bit more when it's um, melting. But yeah, it's it's really, really does smell yummy. And then this is linen and lavender. And I love lavender scents. Now I, lot, I know a lot of people can't handle the really sharp, stringent herbal scent of um, like true lavender. Uh, I don't mind it, I really do like it, uh, but certainly I love it mixed with other things also. And so this is, um, there, it is a laundry scent, uh, but the, the lavender is much softer, it's tamed right down, it's not that really sharp uh, lavender. Oh yeah, this one smells good, this would be so nice. Um, actually I got the windows open today, I might just uh, uh, light this up there because it, it's just it is a laundry scent uh, and that uh, the lavender is really tamed down but yeah I really do like that one and then uh, this one I haven't tried before this is uh, the aromatherapy line and this is called love and it's a mix of rose and vanilla and again I don't like really straight up authentic rose scents that don't have anything else added to it. I like sweetness added or a powderiness or a woodsiness. And then I love rose scents. I just can't handle uh, really sharp cloying 
ones on their own. But this one, I, I sniffed this one and it's so good. I think my blood pressure just dropped 10 points just sniffing this. Yeah, I really do like it. It's definitely rose, but it has um, a real soft muskiness to it. Oh, definitely a wonderful uh, bedroom scent. I really actually do like that one. And then the other aromatherapy line, one I did get, was a Focus, and this is Eucalyptus and Tea. And um, I've tried a lot of their, like, Eucalyptus and Rain, Eucalyptus and Mint I really like. Yeah, yeah, you can get a little bit of that tea scent. The eucalyptus isn't that really herbal eucalyptus. Yeah, this one is tamed down also. Um, but yeah, I, I really do like it. It's, it's uh, not as strong as the eucalyptus in, in um, eucalyptus and mint or anything like that. Yeah, it's very, very nice. Um, and this one I haven't uh, tried before, and I don't know what it's a repackage of. I mean, it smells familiar, but I, I don't know if it's a repackage or something brand new. I don't remember smelling anything quite like it, and that is Sunlit Cashmere. And, yeah, this one's, this I don't even know how to really describe this one. Um, there is a little bit of brightness in there. Oh, I, it's just on the tip of my brain what that note is. It's a little slightly perfumey. It's there's a little bit of sweetness in it. There's a muskiness to it. I don't think I remember smelling something like this at Bath and Body Works. I could be mistaken. If you have smelled it and you think it smells like something, let me know. But um, yeah, I I just really liked it. It's very soothing, almost kind of spa-like. And oh, did that one. Oh, I did get another pink petal tea cake. Uh, I've only burned um, my other one once, and I really did like it. Yeah, this is definitely a, like a sweet rose uh, dessert kind of scent. I really do like it. And, um, oh, lemon mint leaf. I get this every year. This is another one where you throw open the windows when you're cleaning, and it's just so fresh and so bright. Oh, I just absolutely love this one. And I always get a very, very strong throw with this one. Uh, yeah, I really, really like that one. And then Eucalyptus Mint. Um, so yeah, I, I've burned this before. It's, it's great after a 12-hour shift with every bone and muscles aching. Oh, yeah. This one, it always is a wonderful thrower, and it's just so bright and... That one all the time so anyway that's it for the bath and body works and then oh i got this little gaffer for my antibacterial uh cleaner there little holder there it reminds me of mr crabs on spongebob square pants and then they gave out this coupon and it expires may 12th so you scratch this and you either get 10 off 30 Oh, my dogs are up to something. 20 off 50 or 15 off 40. So that's pretty good. Because, um, yeah, you don't, I don't see a lot of 10 off 30s lately. And then for my Scentsy, so like I said, I, I have a lot of the fall, winter kind of masculine scents. So I want to go for, like, bright and springy and happy ones here. Um, so I watched uh, Patricia Nose to Toes. Um, she did a video on the strongest Scentsies. So I think four out of the six were on her list of the strongest scentsies. Um, I just can't quite remember which ones. But anyway, um, at least four or five of them were anyhow. So I will start with um, Make Waves. And this one definitely smells like, like that salty ocean air, brisk salty ocean air. I think this was this. I think this was on the list of one of the stronger ones. Uh, but it's it's a little bit subdued though, so it's not um, it's not like draining my sinuses or anything. But yeah, it's, it's good. It's just watery, sea salty air. And this one is clothesline. And yeah, I do love laundry scents. It just I don't know. It just reminds me of when 
Thursday night was laundry night when we were kids and my mom would uh, just spend the whole day washing and ironing. She even ironed the underwear and I would lay in bed and um, I had my little blankie and I couldn't sleep without my blankie. So she'd come upstairs after she had uh, did the washing and she would give me the blankie. It was warm, it was straight out of the dryer and I remember just putting it up against my face and just sniffing it. It just smelled wonderful. So I just love laundry scents. And yeah, this anyway, little divergence there. Uh, this is clothesline. Oh yeah, this this actually smells more like like detergent than fabric softener, I think. But it is, it's a little bit perfumey, but it's so bright and so fresh and clean. It just smells so clean. And then this is Just Breathe. I love the colors, just nice and springy. Now this one's a little bit eucalyptus minty, but it's not um, potent like um, eucalyptus and mint from Bath and Body Works. It's like a tamed down kind of um, eucalyptus mint. I don't have the notes on me here, but that's what I'm picking up. Oh yeah, but it, again, it's just fresh and clean and bright. I think Berry of Paradise, I think this was on the list of this one of the stronger ones. Yeah, and this is like, it's like uh, berry jam. Mmm, that one smells so good. And this one is pink cotton. So this is another um, laundry type scent. Oh, I think I'm getting nose blind. Do you ever do that when you sniff and sniff and then your nose just says, eat now? This one's, it's a little bit, I get a little bit of fruit in here. Like a sweet kind of fruit. I'll have to, uh, maybe I'll get a little more of the cotton kind of um, scent when it's melting. And then aloe water and cucumber. I love cucumber scents. But this one's not, it doesn't have as much cucumber as like the DW one. It's pretty tamed down the cucumber. And then you can kind of get a, like a, the greenery scent with the aloe. But again, they're, they're all just fresh and bright and clean and refreshing. And yeah, so uh, thank you for uh, Patricia for um, giving me that list of the, the stronger ones. I think the, the only one that wasn't on the list was Just Breathe and Aloe and Cucumber, I think. Not quite sure. But anyway, I'm looking forward to, um, to melting those. And, um, oh, thirsty. I'm addicted to this milk tea that I get in the Asian grocery stores. I just like guzzle it all day. <sighs> anyway, that's it. Uh, so if you tried any of these Bath and Body Works uh, or the Sensies and uh, let me know how you made out with them. And um, yeah, I've got to go do some paperwork, but it's gorgeous outside. It's like 17 Celsius and the sun shining. I don't want to stay inside, but anyway. Um, I'll just do my paperwork really quick. So anyway, everyone take care. Give your loved ones a hug and kiss. And uh, we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.